going on everybody? So, it is Afro Sniper X storytelling time. We had some crazy stuff that happened to us last night. And uh, I've been dying to share it with you guys. So, let's get into it. So, last night I woke up around 1.30, 2 o'clock in the morning to take a leak, right? So, I skedaddle to the bathroom, close the door, you know, get prepared to release the titan. <laughs> All of a sudden, I notice a shadow in my bathroom window and a light, right? So the shadow for a brief second almost looked like somebody was running out of her backyard. Now, I will say this, thank God that wasn't the case. But, right, so I go grab my Glock, I go out to go outside to see what's going on, and all of a sudden I see cop lights like no other. I mean, this is just lighting up the whole neighborhood, guys. I'm just like, what is going on, right? So, because I don't want to be shot, right, I go put my Glock back up get my camera, proceed to walk outside to investigate. Heck yeah, guys, felt like Batman, right? With no Robin, straight out the bat cave, straight out the bed, it's just Batman style. To the rescue, right? To the investigation. <laughs> so I go outside, guys, and this is what I see. Check it out. There we go. A couple more officers arriving. Some people exit in the car now. Cops have calmly got the people out of the car. No shots fired, so that is definitely a good thing. Closer. Yeah, we know the situation's kind of calm. For YouTube, man.
Any questions on what happened on tonight? I'm sorry, but I can't disclose too much. Uh, I, one thing I will ask though, did you hear anything reference like gunshots recently at all? Oh, no, not at all. Okay, no. I actually run a uh, very popular, one of the most popular gun channels actually out here in, in Las Vegas. Oh, yeah. no, so, hey, hey. this happened, man, as I was taking a piss. <laughs> so, I grabbed my Glock, seeing that you guys were already out here yeah, and yeah, yeah. got if my I, camera. If I knew more, I'll let you know too what we're looking for because I'm still aiming. Aiming to Alan Ori, please give us a call. Okay, well, all right, appreciate you. Be safe. Have a good night. Have a blessed one, man. Now, I will say this, guys. I did call Metro Police Department this morning trying to get a report of exactly what was going on. And uh, they have no comment at this time. So, let me tell you what I think was going on. I think these four girls and this one male, which was the driver. The male was driving and the females were in the passenger seat and the back seat of the car that you guys just previously seen in the video getting stopped. Right, guys? Uh... If you listen closely, there is some, uh, the, the cop did say that there uh, was a firearm in the car. He asked the dude. Now, the guy replied to the cop by saying, guys, I just got back from the range. Now, Vegas is a lot like New York. We're a city that doesn't really do much sleeping, right? But uh, as an active uh, range, gun range person, I will say this, guys. There is no gun range open at 1.30, 2 in the morning, right? So that was just a telltale sign of a red flag. And uh, I thought it was extremely hilarious. And if you look at the females, the females are just looking like delusional pigeons, man, in the field. They're, huh? 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 What's going on? Huh? <laughs> Freaking hilarious, right? Uh, and at the end, when I questioned the officer, asking him the details of what happened tonight, guys, he replied by saying, did I hear any gunshots in the area? So I'm guessing it definitely has to do with a gun, right, guys? Being in the car probably wasn't secured right. Maybe they uh, were flashing it around because they. if you pay attention as well to the footage, like I was talking earlier, well, the ladies actually say that they weren't from Vegas. They were from Maryland. So... Maybe they just came out to here to Vegas thinking that they could just do whatever they want. Just get crazy, right? <laughs> I don't know. We're going to uh, keep digging into this and trying to figure out, find out what exactly happened. But these are the details that I have for you uh, guys today. Uh, as far as how many uh, people were in the car. Uh, it was for sure a gun in the car. And... Uh, at, by the end of the video, it looked like they he let him go. So I'm, I'm, I'm assuming there was no laws exactly broken. Maybe people were just timid in the situation and kind of fearful, not knowing what's, what was going on. You know, fearful of the unknown. Not too sure. But uh, I'll tell you what, guys. It was something crazy to wait to at 1.32 in the morning, guys. And uh, it lasted for about an hour, guys. An hour. I was out there for about an hour getting footage, guys. Getting different shots and views and all that good stuff for you guys 
you know, we're a gun channel, right? So it had to do with the gun, so I had to put it in the channel because your boy just do it like that, guys, right? I don't mean to go straight donut operator on you guys. Shout out to donut operator. Love your channel, brother. <laughs> but I just couldn't, uh, I couldn't resist, right? It was just like free footage right outside my door, and I figured it would be fun, cool, interesting bonus content for today. And maybe it's something that we might do get into more in the future. I don't know. If the numbers are right, then hey, I'm just going to fly towards it like a kite, right? It is what it is. I'm your boy, Afro Sniper X. I hope you guys enjoyed today's bonus video. The Day State video is going to be out today, guys, so be prepared for that. The Huntsman 25 caliber air gun video, guys. Heck yeah. If you haven't before, check out the rest of our videos, guys. We have some amazing content. Biggest air gun slash gun channel in the Las Vegas metropolitan area, guys. Oh, yes, I'm your boy, Afro Sniper X. And I will see all y'all. And like I always say, stay popping that air, stay shooting that lead in. Stay dangerous. I'll see y'all next time. I'm out, mother lovers. I'm gonna check my